Welcome Fit On. It's your girl JJ and today I've got a treat for you. It's a bar chair class. So it's a little bit of ballet mixed with strength and endurance and just for a full body just Mmm, tone that is just so beautiful. So make sure you grab a nice dirty chair. And if you need a mat on the floor to make sure your chair doesn't slide around, that's all good. But uh, let's hit it. So we're starting in first position, and that's just your heels put together. They don't have to be turned out all crazy. All you need is using from your hips. It just has to have a little slight turnout. And you're gonna plie and drop your arm and bring it up. Open that one. Plie, drop the arm. All bar classes start with a plie. Take it, and down. In ballet, and up. One more, last one. We're gonna grand plie, down. Now when you grand plie, your heels come up only because you're going so low that your heels come up. Not because you're forcing them up. They come up because you're going so far down. Okay, let's shake it out like one, two, three, four, slide, and up. You know I had to add a little something up in here. A, this ain't your grandma's bar, honey. Take it one, two, three, four, slide. And up, bring it up, and one, two, three, four, slide. And up, tendu to the side, and that second position. And plie, and up, and down. So you let that arm go around the body, lead you up. Plie, and one more. Set, and down, stay here, and pulse, and pulse. Good, hey, feeling that burn, hey. Let's take it up like four, hey. Take it down, and up, take it up, hey. Good, pulse down, six, Five, push it back. So that your knees are pushing back, squeezing the outer thigh. Take it eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Up, vertebra over, roll it up. Good, all right. Let's come in. Curtsy, taking it back. Curtsy, and tendu, and back, and up. Take back, and up. Let that foot slide on the floor, and up. Good, now you're gonna add a crunch to this. Get those obliques. Exhale, down, exhale. Stay up, you're gonna crunch. Eight, seven, six, ooh, those obliques burning, ooh. Three, two, and one, and down. Let's kick it up. Three, up, two, up, last, one. Good, all right. We're gonna bring it around, do all of that on the other side. So grab your chair, flip it to the other side. Now we're using this as a bar. And put your hand on it nice and sturdy. Other arm, arm out in second, plies again. So with your port de bras, that's moving the arms out, bring it down. I'm sneaking in that ballet terminology for you. So you can go saying it to your friends. Yeah, some keywords, right? That's always fun. Show them what you learned. Good, grand plie, take it down, and two. Remember, your feet come up. Your heels only come up because you're going so low that they have to come up. Don't force them up. Three, two, and up. Last one, and down. Two, up. Let's rock it on down like a slide it, push, pour the bra up and rock. Push it down and up and out. This isn't the ballet class my mom paid for. And take it out. Pretty sure she's gonna notice something is different. And up, good, take it a second. And up. Let's do the arms the same way we did in the first place. Take it up in first position. Down, bring it around and out. And down, bring it in, and up. Last one, and down, bring it in. Let's take it down with the out. Hey, hup, hup, yeah, and. Hey, take it down one more. 
Stay here, wings. Push it back, squeezing that butt up. Eight and four, three, two, one. Grand plie and take it forward. Roll it up, four, three. We're gonna take curtsy, take it down. Curtsy, and up, and down, and up, and down, and up, and down. Good, take it down to the knee now. Really crunch. Exhale when you bring it down. Stay up, crunch it for eight, seven, oblique, six, five, four. How does it feel? Stay with me now. All right, let's take a grand plie. Let's bring that back again. We're gonna do it on both sides. You're gonna take grand plie and up, arabesque. So you're facing your bar. Take it down and up, arabesque. Let's do the arms out this way. Take it down, pull it back up this way and up. Good. Give me four, three, two. Stay here. You're gonna pulse it. Take up, up, up. Stomach tight. Four, try to drop those shoulders if they're not hunched up. Two and one. Good, okay. Let's do that on the other side. It's a little challenging at first, but make sure you just get your rotation in. We've already worked these grand plies. Let's take it down, take it down, and pull it up. Arabesque, and up. Grand plie, and up. Arabesque. And up. Make sure that leg is straight when you lift it to the back. And you're rotating your whole body down. Up, hold it here. Get ready to pulse for eight, seven. Notice how my elbows are out to the side. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, all right. Now I'm gonna turn my chair a little bit more so you can see a little bit better. You can stand behind your chair and put your right hand down on the seat and your left hand on top. And we're gonna do a hydrant with the left leg. So bring your knee in and then push it back to an arabesque. So your knee goes to your elbow and push it back again to your elbow and push it back. Let's speed it up, you got that. Take it in. Every time you bring it in, I want you to exhale, because you're really getting those obliques. In the very deep layer, four. Your transverse layer. So it's hard to talk and do it at the same time, too. And one. Now you're gonna extend it all the way to the side. Open, two, and cross, two. And open, two, and cross, two. Good, give me a couple more. Two, stomach is tight, your outer thighs, your obliques, your abs are burning. Let's chug it in, hydrants. Go exhale, exhale. Yes, feeling the burn. Give me a few more. Give me eight, seven, six, five, four. Stomach tight, you'll even feel it in your supporting leg. Two and one, good. Now we're gonna drop our shin down to the chair. You're gonna touch the corner where your hand is and then push it back to that diagonal. It's a very interesting feeling because now you're keeping your hip down. If you've taken the mat with me, you know what I'm talking about, this inverted position. You bring your knee to your hand, going to that corner, but you still wanna lift it higher than your booty, but it's to the diagonal. Yeah, and your knee is facing down. Really come down on that shin to the chair. Come down, shin and chair. Good, speed it up. Down, up, down, up, two more. Two, that burn is real. Good, stay here, chug it. Facing the floor, your left hip is facing the floor. Right hand on the bottom, left hand on the top. For four, three, two, and one, good. We're gonna bring the leg over, Rana Jaman layer, bring it over the top of the chair, and bring it back to arabesque. Bring it over, and then bring it up around the chair, and push it back. Okay, here we go, on the beat, and around. Up, and tap, around, push it back, and up. You could add the arm, around, push it back. Bring that little arm up to fifth, round, back. And up, good. Four, 
three, two, and one. Yes, how does that feel? All right, let's do that. Same thing on the other side. Turn your chair the other way. And we're gonna come down again with your left hand on the seat of the chair and your right hand on the back. And we're gonna take a nice hydrant and push it back to arabesque. Yeah, and hydrant. Remember, every time you hydrant, you wanna exhale, really get in your obliques, really get in your abs. Push. Here we go, speed it up right here. Take it out. Exhale, really getting in that transverse layer of those abs. Exhale each time. And four, three, two, and one. We're gonna extend out this time. So take it out and two and cross and two and out. Straighten that leg and back and out and back. Really make sure your stomach is always staying tight. This is so much core work. Out. Now we're gonna hydrant, chug, chug it in. Eight, seven, six, five. Only it's more than what I just counted. There's actually eight more, sorry. Eight, and seven, and six, and five. I'm with you guys. I'm with you, I'm dying too. And two, and one. Oh, let me tell you, it's always a challenge, but I love a challenge personally. I love a challenge and it makes me stronger and it'll make you stronger.